on the northeast tip of North America, on an island called Newfoundland, there's an airport. It used to be one of the biggest airports in the world. And next to it is a town called Gander. There's a two-person police department. An elementary school. An SPCA. A local TV station. And a hockey rink. It's a small place on a giant rock in the ocean. Everybody knows everybody else. And everybody in this room has a story about how they started that day. Welcome to the rock if you come from away. You probably understand about half of what we say. They say no man's an island, but an island makes a man. Especially when one comes from one like Newfoundland. Welcome to the rock. That morning, I'm in the classroom. It's our first day back, and the school buses are on strike. So I'm covering for Annette, who's running late. Sorry, Beulah. How's the kids? Not exactly thrilled to be inside on such a gorgeous day. So I told them we'd only have a half day this morning, and they were quite pleased. So I told them we'd have the other half in the afternoon. <laughs> Welcome to the wildest weather that you've ever heard of, where everyone is nicer, but it's never nice above. Welcome to the farthest place you'll get from Disneyland. Fish and chips and shipwrecks. This is Newfoundland. Welcome to the rock. I'm in my car. The kids cross Airport Boulevard to get to school, and that time of day, people are in a little bit of a rush to get to work and stuff, so normally, I sit there and run my radar. <laughs> and if they're speeding, I'll stop them and write out a warning ticket. I'll write STFD. Slow the f down. Welcome to the land where the winters tried to kill us, and we said, we will not be killed. Welcome to the land where the waters tried to drown us, and we said, we will not be drowned. Welcome to the land where we lost our loved ones and we said, We will still go on. Welcome to the land where the winds tried to blow. And we said no. That morning I dropped my kids off at school and head to the SPCA where I am greeted by my other kids. All barking and meowing for breakfast and a belly rub. Not that I'm complaining, I love some. But by the time feeding is done, I got to get back to pick up my human kids. So I take just one second for myself and I'm sitting in my car. I'm in the staff room. I'm in the library. And, and I, I turn, turn on, on the radio. You are here at the start of a long, long day. Welcome to the rock. The Atlantic, on an island in between, there and here. I'm running my radar when Barney comes by. She pulls up and she's waving at me like mad. So I roll down my window and she says, Oz, turn on the radio. Slow it down, Barney. turn on your radio. Where our story starts. It's my first day at the station. Where we'll end the night. I'm getting coffee for the picket line. Where we know my heart. Five minutes till my smoke break. Every single flight. I'm off to work at the airport. Welcome to the fog. Welcome to the trees. To the ocean and the sky and whatever's in between. To the ones who left, you never truly got. Our candles in the window and the candles always on. When the sun is coming up and the world is coming short. If you're hoping for a harbor, then you'll find an open door. In the winter from the water through whatever's in the way. To the ones who have come from 